planet number three is Dream Pipes. I like the level design here as well. I would say Dream Pipes is probably the easiest of the three, uh, of the three, uh, the three planets of this episode. Um... Um, the jump button, the jump button makes you swim up, not the up arrow. The up arrow when you're underwater does absolutely nothing. Getting 100% on this, on these levels is not that bad. It can be pretty tough, but it's not that bad. I just can't afford to die now because I'm running out of time on my video camera. I've only got about 20 minutes left. If I'm going for 100%, I can't afford to... Well, if, I can't, if I'm going for 100%, I can't afford to die at all anyway. But yeah, that's a lot of RF missile ammo, and we're going to want it. That's a lot of launcher ammo, too. Spike balls count for a hundred percent, so damn it. Though you do get a bird here, the bird can't go underwater with you, so it's not really that useful. That will be useful though. What is this up here? Just items I have to come back for once I raise the once I raise the water level again. Can't get that yet either. Seriously, compared to Slug Iron, this planet is easy. Raise the water level. It doesn't bring it up very much, but it brings it up enough that you can uh, get up to the next one. go back and get that, which I should have gotten last, and then get those items. The invincibility isn't really that useful in uh, this planet because you don't move very fast in the first place. See, it already ran out. If you don't have RF missile ammo, that can be a little bit hard to hit. You can screw yourself if you hit these out of order, but you really have to make a con uh, conscientious effort to hit them out of order. And apparently those diamonds that I picked up earlier give you more time, because I have nine minutes. I think we're, I think we're, I think, I think we're close to the end. If 
there aren't really any secret passages in here aside from the uh, aside from what's in the pipes. You can screw yourself in this area if you hit uh, hit a water a water switch that's up that up uh, a water switch that's higher than uh, higher up than uh, or lower than the water is at, but it's pretty tough to do that. I'm just saying, but I'm just saying, se sequence breaking is not a good idea. But yeah, so long as I don't, so long as I don't die anywhere, I should have plenty of time to finish the episode. End of the levels down there, but. But up here is stuff. Stuff we need to get. Eh, whatever. Well, it's a life, but I can't afford to die anyway. Here we go. Huh. Apparently, those don't count towards your items. That's weird. 